just destroying the leaves. However, look down in there. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. Welcome back to another one. Today, well, it's Sunday, and we are going to be harvesting our free food from our own garden. Well, here we go. It's time to see what these awesome plants are giving us. I can already see at a glance a bunch of tomatoes. A bunch. Did I say a bunch? A bunch. However, it is not time to pick tomatoes, as you can see. Uh, we do have a couple that's ripe up there. We might get to those, but beans, well, beans are always ready. Not sure how well we're going to be able to pick it up, but pick what up. Oh, on the thing. Yeah. I don't know if the yellow ones would be better just because they're yeah. Might be not easier to see the yellow ones. Oh, look at them all here. Look at all these beans. Here, take it. Let's go. <laughs> I might eat it like that. Diesel doesn't care. He'll eat it. No, no, I know they can't be sprayed on Oh. Yeah, we don't spray anything on these. I don't know if they just die off. Or yeah. They should have some coals. We've never done these kind before, so. Check these ones. Mm -hmm. Nabeen, I don't think you liked them, did you? I don't think you cared for them. Here, Dee. I'll give you one. Diesel. Diesel will eat whatever, whenever, pretty much. Yeah. Diesel's going to pull that one out of your hand, you ain't careful. So, hang on, <laughs> hang on. So somebody tell me what that is. Dead is what it's going to be. I'm going to eat my damn plants again this year. Check out these. You're coming through the front? No, he's right. He's walking. He's under. in the middle. He's like, she ain't gonna get me. Watch me. So when these plants here started growing. We weren't exactly sure what they were, but it's obvious by the amount of tomatoes on them. I remember Farmer Paul was here, and I asked him what they were, and he said he thought they were tomatoes as well. So. The pepper's getting ready to give us a. Oh, we got some flowers on there. Oh, there we go. There's a, oops, they're in the way there. So there's a real tiny pepper right there. Be a while before we're eating that fella. I threatened yesterday to cut these things down, the sunflower plants. However, Jen tells me that those things will not produce flowers until, you say end August? Uh, it said sometime in August. Sometime in August. But if you look at the top of, let me find my finger here, that one right there, you can see the flower forming on that one, and the flower forming on that one, as I look up into the sun. So hopefully we'll get some sunflower seeds pretty soon. If not, from the looks of the stalks on these things, we're going to have to take the chainsaw to get it cut down. I said that the root balls on them, she said they're like this when you take them out. They're massive. She said You're supposed to cut the flower right off the top? You can. And then she said she take she kept some of the seeds from it to replant them. But it but it'll grow back again next year. No, these ones don't. So when these ones are done with the flower and the seeds, pull they yeah. pull them so out, they're she done. Said you can try to get the seeds out of them and then you can replant those. Okay. So uh, Diesel there. trying to get his head into the bean patch there. Go. So we put I think there were six plants in this planter here. Six, six tomatoes. tomatoes? Yeah. And this one over here had five tomatoes because it had the uh, other one, the rhubarb in the, the back. Rhubarb's hidden in there now. Yeah. Rhubarb is hidden. But what's happened is, and we know this every year because we do it every year, is that the tomato plants take over. I mean, look at all these tomatoes. It's not going to be long before we are eating nothing but tomatoes. Look at the size of this guy here. Now these ones over here in the back, these ones here are kind of shaping like the Romas here. Honestly, can't tell you what they are. But if we come to this fella right here, okay, out. that one Those are the beef steak. is a beefsteak. And I believe Jen said these are our seeds, right? 
Yeah, the, the six in here are ours. The other ones these? are the ones in the cool gauges. Okay, so these plants in here, these tomato plants in here, are the ones where we harvested the seeds ourselves. So, it does work. Well, our broccoli is sort of maddening. However, something is just massacring the leaves, which is why we need help with them bugs. But look at the leaves. Just destroying the leaves. However, look down in there. There it is. We finally got one broccoli out of this whole box. Is it broccoli or broccoli? Broccoli? It's a broccoli. So one broccoli. So hopefully the others will give us something. The squash. The squash is doing good. Okay there. There's some more there. Just two in there. But if we come over to the side, and we wade through the jungle. I think this one is starting maybe to form a problem. Look at the size of that. Did you say this is a squash or pumpkin? That's a pumpkin. As far as the squash goes, if you all know the answer to this, let me know. Do you only get one per plant? Because if that's the case, we're wasting a whole lot of space here for, well, one, two squash. Jen has decided to evict the broccoli plant, like I said. Unless you're going to replace it with a bean, but replace it with a pepper plant. That is looking good. So because we had extra dirt, extra seeds, and extra pots, Jen's decided to plant some romaine lettuce and some iceberg lettuce. All right, and here is what we ended up with today. Let's have a look. We got all kinds of beans, one small tomato, two cucumbers. All in all, not bad. Well, that's going to pretty much do it for the garden. I've said it before, I'll say it again. Free food. A little bit of effort, free food. But what I got to do now is watch uh, these will mess up my yard. Come on, buddy. I'm trying to shoot a video here. PG rated, okay? I got some wood that needs cutting. Not a lot, but uh, I got to get it, get it off this fence and cleaned up because... Other plans are going here. Again. Y'all leave me a comment down below. Let Jen know I need a splitter, okay? Get too old for this. Yep. Need a log splitter. <laughs> 